Hello everyone, this is Voltaire42, back from hibernation. Okay, so today, that's right, we are going to try to finish the spire. We are going to go as much as we can and as little time as we can do it in. So that's right, I'm going to be doing a speed up episode. I will be back in just a minute and I will get started. You'll know when I start going basically. Okay, so I will uh, be back at the end of the episode. Actually, no. I'll be talking to you after, throughout the whole episode, but uh, yeah. Talk to you guys later. So, let's see. For me, this has been a day and a half. For you, it's been about, oh, less than a few seconds. Okay, so let's get started with this. Uh, I'm trying a new setup right now. I'm actually recording this in a different program as I'm watching it and I, I I think I might be able to comment a little bit on the actual building process like right now I'm laying down some slabs but I'm not gonna do that much of commenting on it there might be a point later on where I might comment a little bit cuz I actually die at uh, <sighs> yeah I die once in this video. I'm not happy about that, but I'm sure that's going to be a fun time for you guys. Though it's going to still be at high speed, so I don't know how much you're going to like that. And I kept it at high speed because, uh, well, well, for one, I wasn't recording with audio at the time, so really you'd just be listening to me talking over the, uh, the actual scene of me dying so actually I don't remember when exactly I died it might be pretty soon probably not but it, it might be pretty soon oh no it's here there all that <laughs> oh wow you if you didn't see it that was a, a split second I died yeah Ugh, zombies. Okay, so, let's see. Um, hmm. It's actually quite interesting. I've got three things going right now. I've got a stopwatch telling me exactly how long I have left. I've got this audio program running, and I've got the video of me actually in a for fast forward. Uh, I'm wondering if this is actually going to work. I really am. This is going to be interesting. And to tell you the truth, I don't really have a big plan. Uh, last time I sort of came, I went into it with an idea of what I was going to say as a story. This, I, I'm i more trying to figure out an exact what, like, if I'm able to sort of off the cuff come up with interesting stuff so far. Boring. Boring as hell. Uh, but at the same time, you know, not, not bad. Yeah, yeah, pretty, pretty bad. Uh, oh yeah, a little slime there. Uh, yeah. So, let's see. Um, I, uh, I've been having a tough time at work today, or this week, really. I've, I've sort of been a little bit sick. And actually, I'm recording this the night before. Well, I'm recording the audio for this the night before it's supposed to come out. Let's see, it's 9 o'clock now. I normally put it out at 1 o'clock in the morning, the day it comes out. So that sort of tells you how close to the... <laughs> how, how close to the time I normally would release this stuff I am. It... I don't know. I'm. I think it's partially this week. I I really have been a little bit sick. I've actually, my beautiful, amazing wife just made me some nice uh, soup today. Uh, we got a rotisserie chicken from the uh, from the supermarket, and yeah, you know, got some broth and all that, and we just 
made some really nice, you know, simple soup since both of us work. You know, getting a rotisserie chicken. If well, for for kids that have no idea, it's hard, that it's hard to <laughs> to do a uh, to do uh, like a chicken on your own if you don't just always work and all that. It, it, but okay, yeah. So besides that, let's see. Okay. Yeah, but yeah, thanks to her, I'm actually feeling a lot better today. Uh, let's see. So uh, you know, as you know, that I'm continuing the spire, and right now I'm trying to in the video I'm trying to make it taller. Uh, the actual spire itself. The, oh, mm, let me call it the spike right now. I'm trying to make the spike a bit taller so that I can sort of get a feel for how tall I want to do it. Uh, and I'm about to actually go out and uh, take a look to see how tall it is because I want to get a, a nice look from the outside as well. And sometimes what you got to do with this is go out, take a look, and of course because it's so fast you guys can't see it worth a dang. Man. Yeah, you can't see that I was, I stood out there for a second, like, yeah, I like that. <laughs> so I, uh, yeah, and yeah, that, that's my final height right there for the spike. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and there's me figuring out that I can do F3 mode. Uh, oh, I'm pretty bad at this, aren't I? Well, that's life. If you are good at something, you don't really think you're worse. Uh, oh yeah, and this is me getting an idea for how far out I want to get the actual uh, the roof. Because like I said before, I'm going to be putting a roof on here. And uh, this is me going against some... I almost died. And here's me retreating to the water to use it. Because of course the zombies float and they can't really attack you that easily in water. So you can easily just sort of slow them down, which, it, it, which it helps. It really does. Uh, yeah. Uh, so, let's see. So as you can see here, actually, I'm using a dark, dark oak slab, and. There, there was a point in which I was using dark oak wood slabs, and it'll come up not to, it, it'll come up in a little bit, where I'm like, man, I'm, I'm using a lot of dark oak slabs, and I didn't like it. So I f was really trying to figure out what I should use sort of in conjunction because I don't like just using a solid color or texture for something. I really don't. Uh, if it's too flat or it's too solid in any way, uh, and that's not to say that I don't use, like I'll use one wood type, but then use stairs or slabs to create a, a texture within that color. And stairs is a great way to sort of add another layer of darkness on top of something. It gives you a, a great ability to do that. But I'm actually really happy with how this whole, uh, with really this whole build ended up. Uh, as you can see here, I'm using stairs, but later on I'm actually going to remove those stairs because I came up with a really interesting idea. Uh, well, not really interesting, but I, I I came up with a way that you would you didn't have to light up the top because if you put normally how some people would do it is either they use all stairs or all hat all stairs and they make it an angled thing. Well with this, you know, I'm trying to make it a nice sort of domed shape and there's going to be a point in which you're going to want to use in a dome, you're going to want to use a solid block or a 
cracked slab that is on the top. A half slab that's on the top half, which means that it's a spawnable area. Which means that you have to be careful if something spawns up there. But the way I built this in the end, it actually doesn't require any light. And if you're careful, you can actually see that. Because for those of you that don't know, um, I feel really bad because this is like such a Minecraft 101 kind of way of talking. But I know there's literally someone in my audience that does not play Minecraft. And I, I feel like telling him, you know, stuff, because I love him and he's my brother. Uh, it, any full block, you can have stuff spawn on. But if you have a half slab, like uh, the stuff I'm placing now, you can't, uh, mobs won't spawn on there. And, or at least if it's on the lower half, as well as stairs, they won't do that unless it's a flat mob. Wow. Uh, you know what? I, I may have to stop doing that kind of explanation stuff because it just makes me feel odd. <laughs> but, uh, wow. I, I really wasn't expecting to be through like half the f half of the uh, half of it by now. It really wasn't. And I just noticed something. My uh, my my cell phone just stopped, like, uh, or it just went out, which is, uh, I'm using my cell phone as the stopwatch, and the screen just went dark, and it's like, I'm using the stopwatch, why would it go dark? That I feel like that's, like, I use um, a timer, am I using the timer, or, no, sorry, I'm using the timer functionality, I know with the stopwatch, it never goes dark. I can be using the stop the yeah the stopwatch for an hour and it will never just say okay, but I guess a timer you don't need to be that's I, I mean I guess I understand that that's that's not a bad functionality I don't like for this purpose that seems a little bit I feel like that should have a uh, I feel like that should be like an option or something like something you should be able to sort of click on the side of the phone, or not the phone, but on the side of the screen. Okay, so here you go. You can see I'm uh, actually making my alterations now so that, uh, one, I, I came up with the idea of using these slabs to allow me to make layers because uh, having the slabs like that will show as if they are a as if I'm using some sort of stone uh, bracing material. It'll look as if it's holding the wood structure up. Uh, as well, uh, I f also f figure out, figured out that I didn't want to have it just one solid color. And because I like, uh, I, I do really like the dark oak, but I do like the regular spruce as well, as you guys know. I decide I'm just going to use part spruce, part dark oak, and sort of this upcoming thing is how I sort of figured that out. I was going to, I did an outer ring of the dark oak with a inner ring with the rest of the inside filled in with the spruce. And this actually turned out pretty well uh, in the end. I liked it, which was good because that means I didn't have to tear it down. Actually, it's really interesting. I was not expecting this, uh, this whole project to go this fast. I I'm going to be honest. I was thinking I was going to be going for like maybe an hour and a half, you know, maybe even like two hours if, if I wasn't careful, but it really, like, it, it didn't take that long. Oh, yeah. There's this Enderman up there. I'm like, oh, man. Oh. And then it, it just disappeared. I'm like, oh, no. It's in the rain. Of course, because it's in the rain, it's probably, like, jumping around everywhere. But I took another, like, couple minutes just looking around, seeing if the Enderman's out there waiting to kill me. <sighs> Actually, I 
also kind of went out into the rain because I was scared of the Enderman, and I knew he wouldn't attack me when I was up there. Uh, yeah. Now I've got to figure out if I want to do anything in this top area. And I know I've been saying that I wanted to do, like, these legs that come down, but after building this, I'm not so sure. I really don't feel like building it like that would help it in any way, unfortunately. Because I liked the idea, but the actual follow-through, especially since it's an open area, I don't know if that is something I want to do. Oh yeah, I just got a helmet from that zombie kill. Uh, I know it was kind of fast, but yeah, gold helmet. I'm happy. Uh, yeah. I feel bad because I've been saying, you know, I want to do legs and all that, and now i got to rethink my fishing uh, platform idea. Actually, I may not. I was thinking about having just, like, this uh, pillar coming out of the water because of, uh, because I wanted to replace it, but, yeah. Oh, uh, with this, I was thinking about it, and because of my my new digs and how like because of how me it is and the new style using the different kinds of woods and all that having all of that um, just oak wood on the bottom layer it just wasn't that appealing and I know I was trying to go for like this uh, as I moved up I used more exotic woods and different stuff but it I don't know. I uh, I was like, you know what? I'm. I used. Uh, I just used regular stone because I thought, you know what? I just want to. I want to have it. I want to have something. That's. That I want to have something there. Uh, to sort of accentuate the wood, to, to sort of you know, but also for it to be very simple and having just stone. Uh, I thought it was better. Okay, now here, I'm adding chests. I decided because I wanted to do storage up here, but I didn't want to destroy the look of, you know, this great, you know, viewing platform from all angles. You could just look out. So I decided to destroy a little bit of the air ambiance by just filling in some chests. And I actually go through and I label what all the different kinds of chests are going to be. And, you know, I, I don't actually sort anything. Uh, not yet, at least. But, yeah. Uh, actually, this, if I remember correctly, this takes me a little while to actually go through. I, I mean, it must. I still have, like, five minutes left. You know, at the end of the last Speed Forward video, I actually had... A, uh, a chip tune uh, that I found on the internet. I really liked the guy, and I've, I've been trying to find a way to add in some music. And I, I'm probably going to end this a little bit early, um, probably within like the two minute mark, sometime within there. And I'm going to just for the rest of it, I'm going to play a little bit of music. So we got a few minutes. Uh, if if I'm if I'm a little off, remind me in the comments. I, at this point, I'm just trying to get you guys to comment any way I can, even though I know. Yeah, but yeah, I, it it does take me a little while to get these signs on there. Wow. Oh my God. So if you didn't notice, I said I typed mod uh, on the sign. Then I erased that. I said mod again made the sign and then I noticed oh my gosh I said mod not mob so <laughs> I had to break it all over again and that's those are going to be the four chests where I hold all of my tools I don't or all the tools that I use and don't break because I still want to save them for some sort of project I don't know what I'm going to do with it but I want to do something with it oh yeah and here I decided I didn't like just having regular wood like that 
and I liked that look. So I was so I decided, you know what? I'm gonna add some crafting benches. Of course I made one more than I needed. <laughs> so I feel a little bit stupid, but yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, and I have two extra chests in case I want to do something extra. I mean I'll probably have uh, I just thought about it. I'll have like a mechanical box and probably a household box. Yeah, I, I pretty much just figured that out. Th those are two normal boxes I, I usually do that uh, I came up with. Mechanical, it's more of a, like, you know, so that you can use, like, put all your redstone contraptions or, like, levers, stuff like that. Uh, redstone torches, and anything really like that. And then uh, household, it's for stuff, oh my god, look at this. It's like, oh my god, the creeper, get out of there. The creeper did not want to mess with me at all. I don't know why it didn't, but yeah. Uh, and then the household is just, you know, like, it allows you to put doors and trap doors and stuff that you don't normally use, but doesn't really have a great other, like, uh, it doesn't have a real good box to really sort it in. But anyway, uh, I'm going to leave you here to the musical stylings of I Have No Idea. Uh, I'll leave it in the comment description below if you like the music. Go to the link and uh, see it because I, I liked it. And I will uh, talk to you in a few minutes. So I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Well, that's all for today. Remember, this is Voltaire 42. Like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.